Hi guys, welcome to another grocery haul. This one is half Woolworths and half Aldi. My table is full. Um, I'll show you the cold stuff first as usual and I'll pop that away and then I'll do the rest. I didn't really get anything cold from Woolworths, but um, yeah, got a few things from Aldi. It was good they had a few things back in stock that they haven't had for ages, so um, yeah, pretty happy with that. But I got some hot dog frankfurts i've got a big 12 pack of hot dog buns up on the bench that i bought from the spud shed so we'll do hot dogs over the weekend sometime aldi had these strawberry panna cottas the 250 limited time only i grabbed one and for myself and then i thought no i'll grab another one for hubby he can have some of those during the week for his lunches i've got a tub of margarine and two two liter juices uh, orange and mango, I think it is. Yep, yeah, orange and mango. I've got a block of cheese. I actually bought a block of cheese the other night. And I've probably only got about half left, so I needed another one of those. I've got pizzas on the menu this week. Finally, they had salmon back in stock. I actually bought a bag from Woolworths the other week. And you would have seen in my vlog that I put on there. It was really bad. I don't know how salmon can be bad, but even my husband was like, oh my god. So, yeah, would never buy it from there again if Aldi runs out again. I'm just going to go without. Uh, picked up some more lunch meats, just the salami and ham as usual. I've got some nice rolls up on the bench uh, that I got from the spud shed. So I'm going to make those up and pop them in the freezer. They are brilliant. Um, my sister said that her lot reckon they're a bit weird when they're frozen, but my lot said that they're fine. So I individually wrapped all mine and then I put them in a big Ziploc bag. So I don't know. If it's how you store them to what happens to them or I'm not really sure about that but yeah that's um, yeah that's how we keep ours good anyway so that's pretty much my cold stuff so pantry items I just needed to stock up on some beans and things like that pantry is actually getting pretty low in those sorts of things so I got some chickpeas some whole champignons some creamed corn, some black beans, and some corn kernels. I've been loving the putting the corn in my salads. Uh, four cans of diced tomatoes. And I've got another little whole grain mustard. Um, washing liquid, some more fly spray, bin bags. I bought this spray cleaner if i haven't had that for ages and i got some more bin bags some dishwasher tablets i picked up some of these compostable paper like just lunch bags not really sure what the go is with those but they're under two dollars a pack so i thought i'd give those a go i've got a pack of capskins i haven't really been buying them they've been quite expensive these were still about seven or eight dollars i want to say for them I've uh, got some grapes, they look pretty good. I've got some cherry tomatoes, a big bag of oranges. These ones, they're only small, but they were cold and they felt nice, so the other ones were a little bit soft. I've got some more, um, just like salad mix. I've got some sliced mushrooms, a pack of Brussels sprouts, a pack of avocados, there's five in there. I've got some little yellow kiwi fruits a zucchini a cucumber a lettuce that was two dollars fifty it's a big one so it's pretty good um and that's my aldi stuff and then moving into my woolies things i got two cartons of eggs i got two of these beef stock pots some more fruit chutney for sandwiches some deviled ham i love this stuff on toast um, just some lady things, some um, more dishcloths. Aldi hasn't had those sorts of dishcloths for ages, and these were only 99 cents in Woolies, so that was all right. Grab some of them. I've got some of these dishwasher cleaners. They're really good. Um, toilet cleaner, and that's multi-purpose cleaner as well. I actually got that from Woolies. I had gone there first and wasn't sure if Aldi would have any, so that was like four bucks for that one. Uh, versus Audi's like $1.99. Some big storage bags. These ones I didn't even look, but they've got that seal slider, which I really don't like. And I've got four boxes. I've already gone through one. So, um, yeah, I'll just have to make do with those. 
Uh, over the back there, I've got some Special K cereal, a three pack of just baked bean cans. I bought some Makona Skim Cappuccinos, some vermicelli noodles. Uh, I'd already picked these out. Like I said, I went there first, so I'd already got a few oranges, but wasn't very many, so that's where I got more. I've got a bunch of bananas, some peppercorns, some more chewies, two big avocados. These are about $1.80 each. So that was okay. I've got some skim milk. I bought two, four, five, six of those. If one's already open. Some more sesame oil. Love that in stir fries and fried rice. Uh, Big Makina that was on special for about 18 bucks. So I've got some paper towels, a twin pack of men's deodorant, a big pack of toilet roll, and down here I've got some more chai lattes. My husband was drinking a lot of these and it was really weird. He had this weird kind of smell going on. He was thinking it was a soap, but he stopped drinking these and the smell stopped. It was kind of, it was kind of odd. Um, and I was saying to him, the soap that we use, we always use. So this was the only thing that he was thinking it would be because he was having quite a lot of them. So that was interesting. But yeah, I bought these because the kids like them as well. So. And I'm sure one every now and then won't be bad. Got some more tomato juice for myself to drink. They had all these sugar-free bubble teas marked down um, on clearance for about $3.70 a box. So I got two of the peach ones, two of the milky bubble tea, and two of the caramel bubble tea. My daughter loves these. And I just said to her, just add some sugar to it. So that's all right. Um, and these here were marked down, they're normally eleven fifty, and they were marked down to $1.84. There was like a whole clearance section in Woolly, so, um, so there's four in here, and they're $1.84. So I got the last four of those, and she already had one, that's why the box is open, and yeah, it was really good. And I got some Vita Wheats just to have with some tuna and that for lunches for work. And I also got a big pack of wraps. They were on special for four bucks. So that was okay. And my Woolies order came to $191.14. And my Aldi one came to $155.12. That's not really even shopping week. So. Um, but yeah. <laughs> needed some stuff so yeah okay guys i'm gonna go and pack all this way actually i'm gonna have some lunch first i'm hungry it's like 10 past one so give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and i will see you in my next vlog bye